Um, so basically, I'm that. Uh, <laughs> Three, two, one. I'm that's Ned, Ned. And, and that's Horace. Horace. We've been we've been doing sound beam, which is like a um, you can these do, you can now your hand through here, and the invisible beam. Will like and then on these, the sounds. on these, we've we we've we, got um we've got a lot of them. We've got eight of them. Yeah. Um, and they all like do um. They do like you when you tap them, certain sounds come out, and then on the sound, um, the sound beam mechanism. Here, mm -hmm. um, that um, there's all these different settings. Like if I want to do, um, maybe say the saxophone i would tap on the saxophone and then um i will just show you a little bit of mm -hmm. how you do it what do you do if you want to sample oh, if you go back a step what do you do if you want to sample it do you just press on the little the little play button yeah. play on the and you can get a sample yeah and then if you uh now you can do um, you can do all sorts of like police cup, um, this person that's got a deformity, and you can Those do Cookie Man. Cookie Man, we did a version of Cookie Man, and a version of this. And then we did when we first did, mm. we tried out of this, and yeah, and these are very fun. You don't have to uh, do anything. Uh, you can only press the buttons, and this is the speaker. Mm -hmm. You can do it. Ooh. And can you tell us how do you switch the whole thing on? So, so, so this is, has a switch. No, you um, just tap it. You tap, tap it. So, so you tap that in the middle. Yeah. How do you switch the screen? And this one has a button. Okay. Like here. Amazing. And how do you turn and on these, all of these switches? How do you turn on? Um, so here, there's the button. Then you switch all of it off. And how do you know when they're on or not? Um, if you tap them, the green light will come on. Maybe and also, the zero down means it's off, and the one yeah. down means it's on. Brilliant. And these are the sound beams, mm -hmm. and then you can just pull can back, this. and if then you can have a range of few meters distance. Mm -hmm. and change the range. Change the range. Great. And yeah, there's four of them, mm -hmm. but we only need two. And what's the range that we use when we're in this really little room? Around 25 centimetres. Yeah, it's quite small, isn't it? Because yeah. there's only three of us and two mm -hmm. beams, so we don't need that much in way of distance. Yeah. Great. Can you explain to us what um, your story is all about? Oh, uh, so basically... There's, There's orange men. Orange men, and on the on this we did the cookie man setting. Mm -hmm. and so that both edible stuff and they want me protecting me. They're great spider. From and banana spider from the tro evil domino chocolates. Yeah. Brilliant. You need a book about it. And mm -hmm. language. Can you show us the book now? Orange men makes some language. And then here are the. Yeah. Domino chocolates. Domino chocolates. And um, um just a bit of writing. Yeah, there's a bunch of writing. And that's, that's the spider. That's the spider. spider and, and that's the orange man.
In your opinion, what is the best thing about Soundbeam or why do you like it? Because of the cutting and setting. Um, it's just like you don't have to do writing and you don't have to do reading and you just use your like eyes in a different way and it's just nice and musical. You can do stuff like this. And it's just and it fun. It's a bit it like sounds. drumming. And I like drumming. Yeah, I mm -hmm. like sound. And have you found it easy or hard getting to know the equipment and the technology? Easy. Easy? Yeah. Yeah, easy. Do you think you could teach someone else yeah. how to do it? Another student or an adult? Can we try to teach someone Yeah, I'm sure you could, definitely. Maybe we could figure out... Um, to teach our teachers. To teach our teachers. That would be really good. Yes. <laughs> Can you imagine them? I think they'd be really good at it. Um, is there anything else you'd like to say about using Soundbeam? No, not really. It's definitely it's made the state of my favourite day of the week. Favourite day of the week. What about you, Ned? Any final thoughts? It's made thoughts? it my second favourite day of the week. What's your like, I like Friday. Oh. Friday before the school time. I understand. Great. Thank you very much, Horace and Ned.